this is a quick tutorial on how to submit your videos for the talent show um, into Flipgrid, but you can record them first instead of actually recording in Flipgrid. Um, this will allow you to edit your video using iMovie, and then as long as you have saved it to your camera roll to the Photos app of your iPad, then you can actually just submit that file instead of recording it in Flipgrid. If your, the cap on these projects is five minutes, and if your project is close to that five minute mark, it's a pretty big upload time, depending on your internet connection, to get that into Flipgrid. And Flipgrid needs you to stay actively in the app while it's doing that upload. So if your video is long, you're gonna wanna change your settings so that your iPad doesn't automatically turn, up, turn off. So go into the settings app, go to display and brightness, and then go to where it says auto lock and you wanna make that say never. And this is just for the time it takes you to do this project. Then you'll wanna go back in and make it say two minutes later. But that way um, you won't accidentally turn off your iPad when you're trying to upload your video. So if you have that setting changed, if you need it, then you're gonna to wanna to go into your mail app where I've sent you the link to the Flipgrid. And you're gonna click on that link and I'm gonna open it with Safari. You need to make sure you sign on with your Google account because I have limited all our participants to be um, people in our Google group. So you want to do your school account. And then once you're logged in, you'll make sure it says SMS Talent Show 2020 up top. And then you want to use that green plus button. Now you're in Safari and you actually are going to need to open the app. So it'll pick open in the app and it will switch to that. Make sure you're still... Um, that it takes you to the grid for the SMS talent show. And it's gonna automatically have you ready to record your video. And you need to go to the three dots instead of the record button. And this is gonna let you add a video instead of recording a video. So go to those three dots and then choose add video clip. And then you can add the video that you created in a different app that you saved um, into the photos app. So here is the video that I made. I want the whole thing. So I'm gonna hit use in the top right hand corner. And it just takes a minute to prepare the file. So then um, you're gonna hit the This green is how COVID will go. Right I'm Annie McClellan. Corner to go forward and this is where it wants you to take a selfie and for some reason my camera didn't turn on like it was supposed to and this is just like to take a selfie that's your cover photo for your grid so I'm gonna go ahead and hit the back button with the in the bottom left hand corner that blue arrow and now I can hit the green arrow again and go forward back and now my uh, camera is working so I can go ahead and take the selfie that will be the cover photo for my project so I just need to flip the camera, take my cover photo, and then I can hit the next button and put in my name and add a title. So this is what people will see. They'll see your little selfie, whatever you put, and then your name and whatever you're calling your project before they actually click on it and watch the video. And then once you've got a title, then you can go ahead and hit submit video. And this is the part that it takes a little while to upload it. That's um, perfectly okay. You can just, as long as you make it so your iPad won't turn off, um, you can just let it do its thing. And then once it's done, you're in business.